Hi guys, welcome back. Subscribe to my channel and also click on the bell icon to turn on the notifications so that you won't miss any of my videos in the future. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm here with a very exciting video for you guys. I'm going to share with you all how you can remove your upper lip, lower lip and unwanted hair from the chin area. You know, I have a lot of hair on my chin and I it's very nasty and I really don't like it. So this is the method I've been using since past four to five years and it's been very effective and the hair uh, doesn't grow back for at least a month. So I've been using this method all the time, you know, like all the time. And also it needs only two very simple ingredients. So yes, without wasting any more time, let's get started with the video. So what you will need is some unflavored gelatin and some hot milk. Yes, that's all you need to remove your unwanted facial hair. Now let's get started. Heat 3 teaspoons of milk in a microwave and add 1 teaspoon of gelatin into it and stir very well. Stir until the gelatin dissolves completely into the milk. It should be in a smooth paste like texture. So if you think that the gelatin is not mixing properly, then you can pop the mixture into the microwave for 5 seconds. Not more than that, just 5 seconds to make sure the, the gelatin dissolves completely. Now let's apply it before it becomes thick. Make sure it's not too hot to apply or else it is going to burn your skin. So please be careful you guys. Uh, make sure that the mixture is not too hot. So apply the mixture onto the areas where you want to remove your facial hair. For me, it will be my upper lip and my chin area where I have a lot of hair. So apply it using your fingers or a brush as you wish. And also make sure you apply it in the direction of your hair growth and not the opposite side. This is very important because you won't be able to remove your hair if you apply it in the opposite direction. After you apply it, let it sit until it's 101 percent dry <laughs> yes this is very important because if it's not dry completely or if it's not dry in the inside then it won't pluck the hair at all for me it took around 30 minutes to dry down completely so now let's carefully remove the gelatin from the face remove it in the direction of the hair growth and do it in a fast motion as shown in the video. Now, it might look like it's very painful, but trust me guys, it's not as painful as threading. Threading is more painful than this method. Okay, so now let me try to show you guys the hair I managed to pull out. It's very hard to show it in the camera, but I hope you guys can see it. As my upper lip hair was really fine and thin, it's very hard to show it in the camera. But let me show you guys my chin hair as this will be visible as it was thick hair. Can you see this guys? This is how effective this method is. All my chin hair is stuck in here as you can see. My upper lip and chin area is now so smooth as baby's butt. <laughs> okay, so now if you want to remove your full facial hair, then I have a video in my channel, which I'll be leaving the link at the end of this video or in the description box below. So yes, guys, that was the method I wanted to show you guys. It was very simple yet very effective. And I know some of you guys doesn't like um, applying gelatin on your face uh, I understand why but I'm a person who doesn't 
I don't care because look, um, if you can eat jellos, if you can eat jellies, <laughs> if you love pudding, you know, all these things contain gelatin in it. So I don't understand if you can eat gelatin, why can't we apply it on our face? I don't think it's such a big deal. So yeah if you're like me if you're a person like me then go ahead guys because this is the best remedy to remove your hair from your face yes it's a little bit painful but this method is not as painful as threading i guarantee it this is less painful and very effective so i hope you all will try this at home and do comment uh, in the comment section below if you have any questions doubts or whatever so yeah that's it for this video guys i hope you all enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and yes share this video with your friends and family and also don't forget to click on the bell button near the subscription button because um, if you click on the bell button you'll be able to see my videos as soon as i release them yeah and you won't miss them as well so i'll see you guys in my next video and till then bye bye